Hey guys, what is up? It's Duncan, and today I'm here in the third installment of my browser test videos. Previously, we went over the latest versions of all five main browsers. Internet Explorer, Firefox, Chrome, Opera, and Safari. In that test, Google Chrome came out on top, but with two major asterisks, namely privacy and the lack of add-ons or more than even a few handful of themes. Since then, Opera has undergone a major overhaul, Firefox has moved to version 3.6, and Chrome has jumped to version 4. So let's revisit the browser comparison test to see what all has changed. Let's get this one started. Before we begin, let me quickly tell you a little about the tests I used. A good deal of my time was spent testing the speed of the browsers, and I used quite a few tests ranging from SunSpider to Dromeo. I also ran the Peacekeeper benchmark, as well as timing the launch times of the browsers, in addition to the memory usage. Because of the large amount of testing I did, instead of watching this review in a single video, I've split it up into five, one for each browser. In a moment, the browser logos will appear on your screen, with annotations that will lead you to each review of the browsers. Pick whichever browser you want to know more about, and watch the video to see how it placed. Then, when you're done, follow the annotation back to this main video and watch the next browser in the series. Feel free to check out whichever browser you want right now. If you don't see links around the logos, make sure that annotations are turned on. If you are on an iPhone, or don't see the annotations for some other reason, you can check the description where I will have links to watch each video. So that's it guys. Personally, I was very surprised about the outcome, but nonetheless I highly recommend you at least take a look at the winner. You won't be disappointed. So what browser or browsers do you use on a daily basis? Be sure to leave your favorites in the comments. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching.